I'm mortified, Oscar winner Rosamund Pike said of her $58 million role, the Dwayne Johnson film that failed, before HBO's The Last of Us broke the box office curse of video game adaptations. Such projects flopped on a regular basis. Doom, produced by Universal Pictures and starring Dwayne Johnson and Rosamund Pike, was one such flop. The first-person shooting game adaption cost $70 million, yet it failed to make even $60 million at the box office. The plot, the set design, and the acting of the film's actors were all panned by critics and fans. The Rock and Pike apparently had a difficult time filming it. The two Hollywood stars have both lambasted the film in distinct ways, with Pike openly admitting that she was embarrassed by her lack of knowledge of the game on which the film was based. Rosamund Pike on her box office catastrophe Rosamund Pike discussed her experience filming Doom in an interview with Collider. She indicated that she was unaware of the original video game. The actress also expressed that if she had known, she would have done more research into it. Pike stated, I wasn't a gamer, so I didn't get it. If I had known what I know now, I would have jumped right into it and became completely immersed in it. And I just didn't get it. I'm terribly humiliated. I'm humiliated because I had no idea what it meant and had no idea how to go about finding out. Pike went on to say that the internet did not exist in its current form back then. As a result, fans had few options for voicing their opinions about the Doom adaption. But, the actress revealed that she is taking a different approach with her The Wheel of Time series. Pike stated that she had embraced the fan culture and even gone to chat rooms to understand what they love or dislike about the series and the books. She only wishes she could have done the same for Doom. I really wish I had known to do it for Doom, Pike says. So it's a cause of sadness for me that, to be completely honest, I didn't know enough about the company. Dwayne Johnson, her co-star, also had negative feelings about the picture. Dwayne Johnson revealed in a 2005 interview with MovieWeb that he was a fan of the Doom game and also liked the storyline for the film, despite the fact that he thought what Universal Studios was trying to accomplish was quite ambitious. The Rock, on the other hand, had a difficult time filming the project. He described the shot as stressful and bemoaned the fact that he never saw sunlight. As per Johnson, to be honest, it was a really intense shot. We were gone, and I was gone from home. We've been on a sound stage in Prague for four months and haven't seen the sun. Got up at 4 or 5 a.m., no sun, returned at 8 a.m., came out of the sound stage, no sun. As a result, I never saw the sun. When we're being hunted, chasing, there's death, my soldiers getting their heads pulled off, death and dying, and all that, so it was an intense shoot. Yet, he did not overtly criticize the picture at the time. He did it on Twitter in 2018 when he tweeted in support of Rampage's box office, saying, It appears we may have finally broken the dreaded video game curse, and keep in mind that I starred in the abomination doom, therefore I have lived thy curse. While the Rampage picture did not become a pop cultural phenomenon, it did earn more than $430 million on a budget of $120-$150 million. Johnson is now firmly established as a bankable talent. Rosamund Pike, on the other hand, has amassed an enviable career, culminating in an Oscar triumph. Both stars have long since gone on to different projects.